Each Friday, we've been rewarding an organization going above and beyond with free breakfast from Blake's Burger. And this morning, I got to do just that for Hermitage Cat Shelter. Take a look. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. <laughs> How are you guys doing? Good. Thanks so much for letting us in here today. I'm Alex Steiniger. For those of you who I don't know, congratulations on being nominated here and actually winning the competition, the Blake's Lotta Love for Tucson contest. Clearly, you guys are doing amazing work, and I want to tell you who nominated who nominated you here. It's actually Beth Griffin. Do you guys know who Beth is? Yeah. Thank you. Very grateful for Beth. So Beth says the following. She says, the staff here works tirelessly seven days a week because they want to make a difference in cats' lives. They constantly work their own jobs and more. They're a nonprofit, take no taxpayer money, and really rely on donations. All of the staff is involved in fundraising ideas and events. And in addition to their own job description, uh, she says, my husband and I are volunteers there. We're constantly amazed at the job that they do. Please consider these folks for a wonderful breakfast surprise. Thank you, and here we are. <laughs> What's it feel for you to be nominated in this fashion by Beth? You know, I'm really humbled. Uh, not a lot of times do we actually get opportunity to say thank you, like I said, so this is a great opportunity to say thank you for everything that the staff do, the volunteers do. We could not do what we do in this place without everyone's help. Um, their passion, their compassion for the cats is just evident every single day that I step foot here. General population area. All of our cats in this area, we can hold about 90 cats here, are one to 10 years old. Um, they all have catio space, so they're able to go outside, have fresh air. Um, as you can tell, they interact really, really well. And it's a lot of fun to just be able to see them in their natural state. Sister Seraphine uh, was, is our founder. Um, here we are. Uh, this is actually Sister Seraphim. If you want to grab a, a quick shot of her there. Um, in 1950, uh, 1965, uh, she had a call to compassion and really wanted um, to serve as many animals as possible. And we have been able to continue her legacy here um, to you know, extend our services and love to all of the animals that are here, and specifically the cats. So it's a fantastic way to uh, you recognize know recognize her. her. And it's really a little museum too, because there's also an area back here where some of her remains actually lie. Yes, we are a museum for Sister Seraphim's um, artifacts. So this is actually her urn with her ashes and her cat Tad. An incredible place here at Hermitage Cat Shelter. They do so much for the cats. If you want to get a cat, if you want to volunteer, you have to come. And, and actually, Karen, one moment before we go, tell us how important it is that people uh, volunteer in they donate with you? So we are 100% donation driven organization. We do not receive funding from the government. This is all here because we have tons of supporters who open their hearts and give and we need help. Um, we It costs us $60,000 a month to keep our doors open and $50,000 of that goes to the taking care of the cats. So we really need your help. If you go to our website at hermitagecatshelter.org Please click on donate. You can do a monthly recurring $25 actually helps one cat receive food and litter for a year. So if you can open your hearts and help us. And if that's not your, you know, your avenue, there's lots of other ways. You can put us in your will or trust. Um, you can uh, do in-kind donations. Anything helps. Uh, Amazon gift cards paper towels, toilet paper. Um, you can also, if you know, or other organizations that are willing to do corporate sponsorships, that's a fantastic way to help us as well. And of course, volunteer. Uh, you know, we could not do what we do every day without our volunteers. And you can just go on to our website at hermitagecatshelter.org and fill out a volunteer application. Come over, do the orientation and start helping us. Wow, giving a voice to those animals that don't have a voice. You guys are really good at that. So thank you, Karen. Again, kagan9.com slash contests if you want to nominate an organization, but please help the Hermitage Cat Shelter. They really need your support. For the meantime, Alex Steiniger, the Hermitage Cat Shelter. Such infectious passion out there. Now that entire video is on our Facebook page right now. Check it out at Tucson Blend. And stay right where you are. We'll be right back.